playing Augusta National is something on every golfer's bucket list. It's just not something many get to cross off. So we caught up with a few women making their first appearance in the Augusta National Women's Amateur who say teeing off inside the ropes today here at this historic course is something dreams are made of. Oh, it's definitely exciting. Just like being here is amazing. And I feel like the TV doesn't do it justice. Like it's even better like out here. It's definitely hillier, harder to walk. And it's just amazing. And it lives up to its history and its name. The 15 year old doesn't even have her learner's permit yet. But now that driving off the first tee at Augusta National is in her rear view, she's soaking in what that means. Everyone that plays golf wants to do that. And I feel like not a lot of people like almost no people get a chance to do that and I feel like I'm so it feels so special to just be up there and teeing it off. Gamecock Louise Ridquist knows exactly what she means. The day was full of pinch me first for her too. I walked over the bridge on 12 and it was completely still on the water and it's just like a mirror and it was absolutely beautiful and it's something that I will definitely remember for the rest of my life. Even for women coming back to play this course for their third appearance in this tournament, like Bailey Shoemaker, it still feels surreal. I mean, it's awesome. We're like some of the first people out here all year and fairways are lush. Everything's perfect. Like I said to my caddy today, I'm looking at the bunker. I'm like, I've never seen an edge that perfect. Like everything's just pristine and done the best it possibly could be. And the women had the option of finishing their day by playing the historic par three course out here. And we've heard of at least two holes in one, one made on hole six and one made on hole seven. Reporting at Augusta National, I'm Laura Warren.